I just figured I'd do a quick video uh, to show you guys what I'm doing this Sunday afternoon. Just doing a little bit of a Milwaukee charging station. And I just put a couple, couple pieces of, uh, what is that, half inch by six plywood back there and just put two of my chargers in there. Notice this is not a rapid, this is a rapid. Um, I didn't want to put this rapid charger in here because I know one time when I was charging this 9.0, um, this little, let me take this off, this little AC adapter uh, was kind of giving me a couple of issues. So I, I have another one of these non-rapid ones I want to throw in here. I just can't find it right now. So, but anyways, we're about to turn this on and see if it works because you know, let's let's do it without any load first and then we'll put a couple batteries in there so let's go ahead and fire it up all right guys van is on we got power um i'm just this is all temporary gents i'm just gonna try i, I really want to see if this is going to handle the load of charging four batteries i don't know if it is but this is temporary i just got a cheap little extension cord running back there and um just goes into that little three-way splitter and you got two chargers on it so this like i said just quick um this is definitely not a permanent but but we're about to try uh see if it can charge some batteries so got this little 3.0 it's saying it's charged i try to keep my batteries charged all the time See that one's charged too. See if it's 9.0, see if it doesn't give us any trouble here. See that one's charged. So we're still showing green. Uh, so 2.0 here. See that one needs to be charged. I guess that's the bad part when you always keep your batteries charged. Um, so anyways, like I said guys, just a little it's a quick video um today is sunday i was on call thursday so as you can see i have a bunch of empty jugs those two are new um i got some more jugs out here they got another rapid charger right there um so tomorrow i'm actually gonna swing by the shop and throw all this trash away see that this is all trash. This is trash. That box is trash. Uh, everything's trash. So anyways, gents, like I said, quick video. Just wanted to show y'all a little, just a little homemade uh, charging station. And I also got this uh, toolbox this week. Um, see if maybe I can do a van tour sometime this week or so. But, Pretty much I just use it for my tools. I got my bandsaw. Jenna Jameson, chews through pipe like it's cool. Uh, got that big, well that's a mid torque impact. Got another 9.0. And I got a Sawzall, a couple more batteries, 12 volt hole saw kit. And just a, this is just crap that I don't use. And this is just a couple extra meters and stuff I don't use. So, um, like I said, I'll do a quick video sometime uh, later on this week. But I just wanted to just wanted to throw this in there. Um, not exactly sure if I'll I'll be charging these on the move. For those of you Milwaukee guys, you know that the only thing holding this top part from this heavy bottom part is these screws, and they tend to. They tend to break off. Actually, this 9.0 has already broken off. But you can see right here where it broke off and I had to glue it with super glue. See, this one hasn't. So I probably won't charge these on the move. Um, I hardly have to charge batteries anyways. This is the one I use the most just off of my impact. But that's it, gents. Quick little video, Sunday. Uh, I was out here just messing around, cleaning my van and organizing and all that, and got to do some trash trash run tomorrow. So, 
basura all right guys i'll try to get you a service call video this week thank you all for watching guys i really appreciate all the uh support and i'm almost at a thousand subscribers so uh let's see um let's see how fast we can get there i think i'm like 20 away i'm at like 980 right now so uh, all right guys we'll see you